Good afternoon, Brooke. This is Kara from Arlington Toyota. Virtually, I'd like to bring to you a 2016 hybrid limited model of the RAV4. Here you'll notice this is the home screen that you would receive with the vehicle. You can actually set up this screen to customize it to what you actually want most. This right here is displaying any audio that would be playing. XM does come with the vehicle for three months. After that, you could obviously choose to continue with the service. AM, FM, CD, Bluetooth, where your phone could actually play music, as well as auxiliary would be available. Going back to home, if your phone were paired as well, you would have the option of having four preset favorite people to call just a click away. Navigation, I love Toyota's navigation, very user-friendly, and it actually displays the speed limit sign right here if you're on any major road. So if you're in an unfamiliar place, you'll know the speed limit. So over here, you'll notice there's an app button. We're gonna click, don't tell me, I'll tell you about that later. Uh, but this is where you'll see if your phone was paired, it would have your call history, your favorites, your actual contacts and a dial area. And um, obviously we could pair up your phone in person if you were here to show you those things. Predictive traffic and weather, which is ran by satellites in 15 minute intervals, it will update you. And there is something you can download called Intune to provide extra icons such as Pandora, iHeartRadio, Slacker, which is Pandora without commercials, as well as uh, applications where you can book a restaurant reservation or purchase movie tickets through the screen. There's much more that I can go over with. This is actually called Intune. This is also where if you put the vehicle in reverse, it will have your rear display camera. You can see the bumper right there. Two feet from your bumper is this red line always, which will be the back of a parking spot, typically. The yellow lines, if you turn the wheel as I'm turning it, it will predict where you're going to turn. And the blue lines you see there will be um, what you would line up with the white of a parking spot. Show you the interior of this vehicle I have here. Soft tech interior. which is actually better than leather. It doesn't get as hot or as cold, more stain resistant, durable, and you do not need to condition the material either. To answer calls, hang up or ignore. Once your phone is paired, calls, text messages, and music will come through the screen and audibly. There's a display panel you see right here that we can actually control with these little icons. This is gonna show what's left in your tank, what you're averaging. Keep in mind, it doesn't really know what someone's averaging yet. I'll show your energy monitor. If you do swerve in another lane, a coffee cup icon will come up and it'll actually beep at you, which you can turn that to um, different settings of how sensitive you'd like it to be. This is your compass where also the speed limit sign will display here for you if you have it on the screen. Any audio which you can navigate through by clicking this circle button here. And it'll actually go through the different sources such as AM, FM, XM, CD. This is going to be your settings for your lane departure alert, which you can turn on here. Over 32 miles per hour, you will have um, something that's going to give you a little bit of steering assistance. If you were to switch from a different lane accidentally, basically swerving, it'll pick up the lines. You'll notice right there, those lines would be filled in if we were actually on a street that had lines. Also, dynamic radar cruise control, which is going to adjust your speed to a vehicle in front of you. Say we're at 50 and the vehicle in front of us makes it slower than 50. It'll actually decrease your speed, safety purpose, obviously. If they get back over, it'll bring you back up to the speed that you were set on. Once more, any messages, maintenance needed on the vehicle, and any missed alerts will show on this display. And then here is your actual settings, pre-collision sensor. So if you are coming too fast over 15 miles per hour at another still object, it's going to do everything it can to try to mitigate the situation. It'll come up on the screen saying break and giving you extra brake force at that time. Parking sonar, which you can turn on or off. Your power back lift gate. We'll get outside of the vehicle and show you a little more, but I did want to bring to your attention the vehicle itself. If there is music playing, say there is now, Click it on. We can mute just by holding this. And this is our Siri Eyes Free where you can speak to the vehicle, tell it to do things such as um, navigate to this destination, call this person, what is the weather, and you can even train it to know your voice and how you pronounce things by going through 10 different phrases. 
Over here, you will notice uh, on the mirrors, I'll get out and show you better, but there is something called blind spot monitoring. So it'll actually have an icon light up on the mirror and it'll show you if someone's in your blind spot. Memory seating, home link for your garage, and there's a frameless rear view mirror on the limited model, which in person looks very good. Moon roof. And then we're gonna get outside the vehicle and show you a little bit more. Uh, this is gonna be your USB auxiliary, 12 volt, as well as heated seats on each side, different driving settings, and then a, another 12 volt inside the glove box. Another great feature the vehicle has is the push to start button, as well as the smart key system, which I'm about to show you the benefit of having. There's little grooves right here you'll see on the handles. If we have these keys on our person, in our pocket, in a bag, anywhere on us, we can actually just put our fingers here to lock the vehicle using the iron in your fingertips. And to unlock, it's as easy as placing your hand beneath here. So that's a great feature. You can have it trained to open all doors or just one. And then these are going to be the chrome accented alloy wheels on the limited model. You'll notice the chrome accent handles, turn signal indicators here. This year they did redo the front of the vehicle. The grill you'll, you can see is very different than prior models as well as it looks very aggressive. Sonar on the front, five mile per hour front and rear bumpers to protect your frame from damage. All of the hybrid models will be all wheel drive. And this is just a brief video for you. Keep in mind, I'm missing many things. I just wanted to at least show you so you can know what we're referring to here power back lift gate, which you can actually set to five different height settings. And the rear beneath here, full diameter spare. Uh, it's actually going to come with two years of roadside assistance from Toyota at no cost to you. This back piece is flippable, uh, reversible if you will. So if you have anything that would mess it up, it's hard on the side that you can flip to. The seats are extremely easy to navigate, regular gasoline, anything else is really just a waste of money. And let's actually unbuckle these. See this lever here? As easy as that, the seats do fold down on each side in a 60-40 split. So I do appreciate your time. I'd love to answer any questions you may have. The vehicle does come with warranties and maintenance at no cost to the customers. So I'd love to go over what that entails too. Thanks so much. Again, I'm Kara, and I really do appreciate the opportunity of working with you. Thanks, Brooke.